So engineered versus solid. Mm -hmm. I, I know ourselves, we used to be even 10 years ago, 95% solid, 5% engineered here in Saskatchewan to pretty much the opposite. Yeah. Are, are you still finding that across um, Canada? We're, we're finding uh, about a 60-40 split, 60% on the engineered side versus 40% solid. Mm -hmm. So you're exactly right. Over the last 10 years, it's, it's flip-flopped. Um, you know, for us, you know, our engineer product is a very high quality product. So as soon as we have board widths over three and a quarter inches, you know, to five or six and a half or seven and three quarter inches, we want to go to that engineer platform. We don't want gapping. We don't want issues mm -hmm. when it comes to that. Um, whereas, you know, right, three and a quarter uh, inches in, in width boards and narrower, we may as well stay in the solids. So there's just a different you know, for us, because of the way that we do our lumber, there's no difference in the visual of our floor, right. whether it's engineered or whether it's solid, mm -hmm. you know, the way that, with that we manufacture our, our, uh, our top layers. But, at the, you know, for the decision on which to go with is, has a lot of factors to it. You know, if I was in, an, in a single family residence, wood subfloors, you know, the typical house, and I wanted a three and a quarter inch board, you may as well go with solid. You know, there's really, really no, no need to have an engineered format for that. That you know, you're actually going to save money to go three and a quarter inch solid too, because mm -hmm. believe it or not, solid wood is less expensive these days than our engineered, which and is that's crazy. something a lot of people have their head their trouble wrapping their mind around, right? Yeah. But when you see as you start explaining, listen, like the the types of plywoods, because that's one big thing to hit on. Mm -hmm. Not all engineers created equal. Exactly. Right, like the the zero void core that you guys use costs more than the wood itself. That's right. Like exactly. that. That's just crazy, yeah. right? But that's what gives it the stability, allows us to have a product that we've been selling since 1999. And I've had literally two issues with the Mirage Engineered since that time. And it was the first couple of months because the construction has been fixed since. Like, that is amazing. We just don't have issues, especially in, in the environment, you know, in, in, the, in the prairies, which is the harshest environment for, for hardwood flooring uh, in the country. And uh, you're exactly right. It's the, it's the materials that we, how we dry our lumber, the materials that we use within our cores. We use a Baltic birch plywood core on, in, in Mirage, and uh, it's the highest quality um, uh, plywood that you can buy, marine grade. So we just don't have that movement. And you know what's happened a lot with uh, engineered is you know sometimes engineered as a um, category um, got a little bit of a bad rap because a lot of people bought low quality, really really low quality engineered. Uh, when it first came out, it may have had issues with it. Mm -hmm. um, but especially in engineered floors, you